So when is the slope undefined? And what does it mean for something to be undefined? Whenever you have a fraction, if you have a zero in the denominator of that fraction, this value is, it doesn't have a defined value, it's undefined. We don't know what this is. Is it a number like five? Is it infinity? Is it zero? We can't define it. So anytime you have a zero in the bottom of the fraction, you have an undefined value. Now, there are different types of slopes that we can have for a linear equation. We could have a positive slope where the line is going up. When the line is going down, we have a negative slope. And for horizontal lines, the slope is zero. But for vertical lines, we have an undefined slope. You could think of it as one over zero. And let's see why. So let's say we have a graph and we have a vertical line. And let's identify two points along this vertical line. Let's say the coordinate of this point, we'll say it's three negative one. And for this one, let's say it's three comma two. Calculate the slope of the line using those two points. To find the slope, we could use this formula. It's rise over run. It's y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So we could say this is x1, y1, and we could define this as x2 and y2. So using that formula, we have y2 is 2, y1 is negative 1, x2 is 3, and x1 is 3. 2 minus negative 1, that's the same as 2 plus 1, which is 3. 3 minus 3 is 0. So notice that we have a 0 in the denominator of the fraction. So that tells us that this slope has an undefined value. Anytime you have a vertical line, the slope is always going to be undefined. Now let's compare that to a horizontal line. Let's say we have a line right here. And let's identify two points on this line. Let's say this point is at negative 5, comma 3. And we'll say this point is negative 2, comma 3. Let's calculate the slope of that line. Let's see why it's going to be 0. So this is x1, y1. This is x2 and y2. So using the same formula, y2 is 3, y1 is 3, x2 is negative 2 minus x1, which is negative 5. 3 minus 3 is 0. Here we have negative 2 plus 5, which is positive 3. So anytime you have a 0 in the numerator of a fraction, the entire value of that fraction will be 0. So it doesn't really matter what the x values are. The slope of a horizontal line will always be zero and the slope of a vertical line will always be undefined. Now, what are the equations of these two lines? How would you describe their equations? What is the equation of the vertical line? How can we write an equation if we don't know the value of the slope? So here is the slope intercept formula. It's y equals mx plus b. How can we write any equation for a vertical line if, we, if the slope is undefined? It turns out that there's a very simple way to do this. All you have to do is look at the x and y values and see which one is constant. The y values, they're not constant, but notice that the x values are constant. It's always three. Any point along this vertical line will have an x value of three. So to write the equation of a vertical line, it's simply the x coordinate. The answer is gonna be x is equal to three. 
whenever you want to write the equation of a horizontal line, focus on the y value. Notice that the y value doesn't change. In this case, it's always positive 3. So we simply write y equals 3. So that's how you can write the equations of a horizontal line and a vertical line. You don't need to use the slope in order to write those equations.